So we're going into the controls, we're going to the stages, we're going to the characters, and we're going to the action very shortly. I don't know, man. Destiny, if he's fun to be out here, I really want to see him like pull off some flashy stuff, man. He's got mm -hmm. a lot of people supporting him. I mean, regardless of the result, I'm sure they'll be happy because he gets to be on stream and show off what he has to offer. Yeah. Uh, you want to make a statement for your home country. Yeah, I was talking to him. I was like, how are you feeling coming out? He's like, honestly, I don't know how I'm going to do, but I'm really happy to have this opportunity to come out and play. I just want to play as many people as possible and get this... Uh, and get as far as I can. Yeah. That's why you want to shout it out to QGG, man. They do this stuff all the time, literally all the time. Get, give people opportunities. That's why I'm here. Like, I would not be here if not for QGG. So it's like, shout out to them, man. Yeah. Putting, putting on this show, putting on this venue, getting the stream going. And right here, Meta Knight versus Daisy. This is a historically awful matchup in Smash 4. But in, uh, in Ultimate, definitely different story. In Smash 4, Meta Knight versus Peach, there was just such an early percent window to the latter Peach. But in this game, the fact that Meta Knight's dash attack is different, up air is a little weaker. The percent is like really small on Peach. So honestly, I think even the Meta Knights are like, this isn't as good as a matchup anymore. For sure. It's just like, and it wasn't that like a free matchup for Meta Knight. It's like Peach and Daisy could still, I mean, say Peach could stuff like camp out in that last game. But like the rage, like uh, a, pun a punish, you don't want to leave yourself open for one punish to be your stock. Mm -hmm. And in a two stock meta, that's a big deal. All right, here we go. Get some up airs but barely misses it. Like I said, that uh, Peach already just a weird wait, but already gets that <laughs> stitch. Stitch to fair, and it's like, where, what lead did you have? <laughs> All right. Good job keeping oh, your float. Can you get the yeah. punish? Yeah, really hard to hit that uh, that parasol. This is actually a really good daisy all, too. The black and green, I like it a lot, because the parasol is magic there, too. Clean. I like, Daisy's, I, I like Daisy's colors more, honestly. Yeah, really clean. Good addition to the game. All right, tries to go for that dimensional cape swinging. Dimensional cape is such a good move in this game. All right, applying this ledge trap situation. So not really getting the pressure that he wants, though. I guess that's fair, but not going to kill just yet. Destiny in danger of losing his stock. Meta Knight, not a heavy character at all. One of the lights in the game, by the way. Mm -hmm. That dash attack already taken it. Yeah. And this game has been like silently updating, like uh, patch by patch. They've been updating like hurt boxes so they can actually get hit by the full hit of dash attack. So uh, I don't think Mennonite was one of those again, and definitely was. So uh, he used to always like whiff like the last hit, but now like it's a more reliable move. Uh, gets this grab. The lead is slowly going away from Destiny. And the problem with Mennonite in this game too is you have like this percent window where it's really easy for Mennonite to kill, but. Once you get past that uh, area, it can actually be really hard because up he either kills really early or really late. <laughs> mm -hmm. Maybe he wants to put him like in a mid tech situation and catch the attack with the up B. Mm -hmm. Like uh, an up B ground who probably won't kill till like 130 ish. Ooh. So he gets the forward throw, tries to apply the edge guard situation. Applying the pressure does not get the forward air. Back air though. That, that back air scooping him up. That was a really, was a really good call. I don't even think Solex thought he was going to get hit by it. Yeah, very clean coming out from Destiny. Now we got even stocks of Wait a minute. percent. Oh, no. Oh, my no. God, that kill. The matchup. Yeah, the floatiness of Daisy is going to allow for that to be a little bit easier. Like, it's not as easy as it used to be, but it's still there. Yeah, exactly. It's still there. Honestly, it didn't even look like it should have connected. <laughs> yeah. Right, we are not complaining if we're Destiny. Exactly. So. Very hard spot to be in. And now that's a lead out of nowhere. Mm -hmm. And what's worse now is uh, this Rage on Meta Knight. I'm, I'm confident one dash attack will be it. Here we go. Oh, here we go. Oh. Gets that fair one. I asked clean. I have not seen that. That's a really good option. Yeah, Meta Knight fair one is so good. It sends you up at like this fixed angle, pops you up. You're able to get up airs, up Bs. It's a really good killing option. But the anti-air option coming out of Soul X, getting that up smash, and now we're at even stock yet again. But we saw how explosive that Meta Knight can be in this matchup. Here we go. Right, great whip punish. Oh, and that's a tipper oh, dash attack. That's oh. probably going to be it. Oh, good air dodge. Getting him out of the last scenario does not allow Destiny oh. to get more hype, but he doesn't have a jump. Calls out. Calls him out with the tornado. Yeah, Soul X, though, now getting another chance at life. And this is just game one. This is already an intense game one. Right? I'm. That up B almost killed. I don't think that was great DI, but you know what? He's still alive. Let's come out with that back air. This back air pressure is so good. Oh, here we go. Now we got even percent, and now it's very scary for both players. Down smash, get him off. Oh, oh. Gets that neutral get up, but barely missing that. Yeah, barely missed the frame there, man. Unfortunate for Destiny. Now he's got to push a little farther. Oh, yep, there we go. That fair one, like I said. Oh, wait, he's not even dead. Good DI. He needed that DI to stay alive, and there he is. Now trying to get to the ledge. Does not to get back here. That's it. Yeah. Used a little too many resources there. Destiny calling him out. Man. How's those six jumps? That was... That was intense, man. We're seeing it live, man. Uh, as the wave progresses, the, the action is just getting tighter and tighter.
That was an intense. Just that was just the first game, Rickles. <laughs> uh, I want to see more games out of these guys. So I want to see the full three. Yeah. But, uh, game two, we're gonna be going to FD. That's a great stage for both players. So we're yep. gonna see some combos. Yeah, I'm learning, man. I'm learning to watch out for fair, dude. Mm -hmm. uh, Mad Knight's fair. Leads to some good stuff. Leads some some nasty confirms. Good stuff. Speaking of nasty confirms, yeah. Peach out by the other on the other hand. There we go. Get the down throw. Uh, FD, I kind of like this, uh, you know, it's like, I don't know, I feel like Meta Knight is going to be really good on a lot of stages. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised, uh, surprised Solex didn't go for something like, uh, maybe not even Smash but like uh, Kalos or right. something. Get some look at that flat ground. Is that it? Yeah. Oh my god, taking that first knock, only 21%. Yeah. Destiny looking really good. A lot of Meta Knight's normals and like aerials, they just have a lot of good knockback, and the back area is so crazy good option off stage. Mm -hmm. Knockback growth on it is insane. Mm -hmm. uh, with a down tilt, here you go. Uh, missing his combo. Probably the big reason why he picked FD to get the best out of his combos. Uh, you saw him go with that down tilt, drag down up here. You saw him practicing that in the <laughs> early before the set. I told you, man, you got to get that with those unlocked. Right now, the side B. Looks like Destiny's kind of looking for that opening to get that dash attack to kill him again at some earliest percent. Oh. Tries to anti-air with the up smash again, but does not find the hit. There's good damage coming out from Destiny. All right, tries to call him out with the tornado. Yeah, and how is Soul X going to take the stock? Now, back there almost doing the trick, but living just enough. Oh, Dimensional Cave is getting risky. At 55, man, trying to send a message. Oh, where's it going to be? Where's the pressure? Oh, man, that was devastated the stock. Hmm. So X is looking a little desperate for this uh, for this kill right now. Oh, and Destiny kind of like making some big plays right now. Dash attack not even going to kill yet. Uh, punish that? Nope. Makes a roll instead of a probably a dash attack that he wanted. Donna's still not killing. This is so close. A lot of them actually case, a lot of them use the movement. Mm -hmm. I really don't like how much Destiny was approaching Soul X at that point. He gave him a lot of options to really kill him. And That's eventually cool. it worked out. And look at that. Our damage already evened up. Yeah. Even game. He didn't yeah. have to. Yeah, he lost, didn't have to lost one conversion already, 80%. Now the stage is working out, but again, this is still two stocks apiece. It's a, not the percents that matter, but the stocks. Mm -hmm. It's a dash attack. Oh, pressure. He had the air dodge. He had Soul X panicking with the air dodge. Oh, up there to side B. Hell yeah, I'm going to go for it. Had he got like more hits off the side B, he, he could have used that percent, but uh, good on, on Soul X. Staying alive. Trying to get the second stock off. Right now, Destiny's probably going to be looking for another one of these fair ones, but that's really scary against Peach because Peach's anti-air options are just like that. Do not be above Daisy. That up smash is going to do it for the second stock. And Solex now playing with lead in this game, too. Yeah, 40%. 40. Just trying to get off the ledge. Up B is going to kill. All right. Here's the last stock scenario. Uh, we need Solex to bring us to a game three if he wants to stay in winners. Yeah, but the... <laughs> the name of the game is, can you avoid getting dash attacked at 20%? <laughs> Once you get to that 30%, you're going to be fine, but Destiny's going to be looking for that, just a little more percent so he can get that ladder in and close out this stock, or this set. Yeah, good damage right there, 63. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh, my God. Uh -oh. oh, no. All right, 30. Oh, down oh, smash. back to the landing. All right, just... <laughs> this gap slowly closing. The name of this set has been one person gets a lead and the other one evens it up because the other person just gets comfortable. Yeah, that's now true. this is scary. Goes off with a fair. Oh, barely no. misses that. That might Good be it. But that's really smart to go to go to ledge. And this is uh, looking like it's very possible. Is that gonna kill? No, not yet. It's very I possible for Solex. Oh, Destiny's no. probably gonna try to call this out. Not back here. Way too early for that up B. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna do it. Some peaches you see them will go that up B and kind of wait out there because some people can't call it out. But Meta Knight, six jumps that back and that hits across the country.